Governor Nixon joined Truman State University officials to tour Baldwin Hall, one of the largest buildings on campus that is in need of repairs. Baldwin serves several academic departments and houses the 1400-seat University Auditorium. This is a major facility that badly needs updating. It was built in two phases, the first being almost 80 years ago and the second more than 55 years ago. Yet Baldwin Hall is structurally sound and the university has identified several vital areas for renovation that will be more cost effective than constructing a new building. Last year, the Missouri General Assembly passed additional bonding capacity, authorizing up to $200 million in projects at community colleges and four-year institutions across the state. This building is not only important to the university, but to the community. And so we're very happy that uh, we're moving closer and closer to getting some needed renovation that's been needed for a long time. The students and the faculty who have to uh, teach and learn and work here every day understand uh, how, how great the need is. Uh, they are the ones who have to go to classes in one room where the temperature might be 40 degrees and to another room where the temperature might be 95 degrees. And if anyone has tried to uh, learn and teach an environment like that, they know what a challenge it is. 9.2 million of these bond dollars will go to improving Baldwin Hall's restrooms and HVAC systems and installing a fire sprinkler system. This is a project that will continue the tradition of high standards set by Truman State, its faculty, and its students. To learn more about the governor's commitment to higher education, visit governor.mo.gov.